So, you know, a lot of times people will ask me, Andrew, like, what does somebody do if they're a CFO? Because they're like, oh, I don't know. Like, what does a CFO really do exactly? And it is complicated because there's so many different things, especially when you think about all the different industries. So if you're thinking about being a CFO right now, like, what are you actually helping your clients with? Like, what are you doing for them? You know, are you just doing the bank recs, the month end close? Like, are you even meeting with them on a monthly basis? Right? Are, are you or your team or your staff? And when you do meet with them, are those scripted interactions, right? Are they choreographed? Like, do you know exactly what your team is saying or do you know exactly what you're gonna say to basically help that business owner, that individual, like get a transformation in their business? One of the key things I always think about, and I put this slide, this is actually in one of our sales presentations to help people get CFO clients. You can see here, like at the end of the day, what, when, when you're talking about being a chief financial officer for somebody, what I like to think about is, okay, so where were they at like before they worked with you in terms of revenue, salary, net profit, debt, net worth, what was their age? We might also look at some other things like staff, depending on your industry or how you help people. So you could look at sort of revenue per full-time employee. And then what do they wanna to get to this year? And then what do they wanna to get to by the time they're 65? Like you gotta understand that you're not doing everything that needs to be done for them to achieve these goals. But like, uh, you should probably be talking to them about this. But you know, most people that are doing accounting, they're doing monthly accounting services, they're just like doing the bank recs monthly close. They just like email the client, they don't even meet with them. Or if they do meet with them, they're just like talking about the transactions and everything, right? So the biggest problem is if you're doing CFO services or you wanna start doing CFO services, like you've gotta have a goal with the client. Like what's the goal? Is the goal revenue growth? Is it profit? Is it increases in profitability, increasing the enterprise value of the business? Is it is it selling the business? Is it saving for retirement, paying down debt? Like what is the goal? And then you can actually help them understand, okay, here's what's going on. Here's your set of goals, right? We have a number of different goals. and based on the financials, this is what it's telling us about your progress towards those goals. And then actually helping them map out specific action steps in the business to be able to get there. And then when you come back a month later and you have another meeting with them, actually holding them accountable to see, okay, did you do it? And if you didn't do it, why didn't you do it? Is it a tactical issue? Do they not understand the numbers? Do they have fear and anxiety about taking issues on key points that are gonna get them to get the transformation? And so, a lot of times people have trouble understanding what it is because it's so vast what a CFO can do. It's less about, oh, I'm gonna provide this specific forecast. If you think being a CFO is just providing a budget or just providing a forecast, you're missing the whole point, right? Because it's not, it's not important that you give somebody a report. Information in and of itself is not that important. Implementation, getting them to actually implement in their business to get a financial result, to get a business result, that's really where the value is. And so a lot of times I see people wanting to get into CFO services and they're so fixated on the report, the report, the report. So if you've been thinking about the reports or if you're not even doing this and you'd like to work with us, there is an application below this video. You can fill that out. You'll set up a time to meet with me and my team. We'll go through an entire presentation where we'll talk about what it's like to work with us. And like I said, this is just one slide. We get people that wanna be a CFO, about 160 slides like this to present to a potential client about, hey, if we were to do CFO services together, like this is kind of what it would look like. And so, you know, we have people upselling existing clients, people paying 200, 300, 500 bucks a month, upselling them to 1,500, 2,000, 3,000 a month for going through and, and working with them on an ongoing basis. And then if you're talking to a brand new client, how to get them to come in and see you at that level right out of the gate. So uh, if this isn't something that you've been doing, honestly, it's worth the time to set it up, speak with me on my team, see how we do it, show you how we do it, and see if it makes sense for us to work together. All right, I'll see you on the other side.